This is the Marcus Bona MB4 Baby 2. It's an awkward name, but a really cool case. It's in one of Marcus Bona's newest colors, new gray with green trim. Just as a reminder, at least from Houghton Horns, you can order any color Marcus Bona case you want um, with no extra charge for the customization, including any sort of trim or any sort of nylon material. This is one of the slimmest fully hard cases that you can find. Although the MB3 and the Marcus Bona MB1 both have a slightly smaller footprint, what makes this case special is the fact that it is so slim. It can fit into any airplane overhead or almost anywhere else you wanna fit it. This case has a nice spacious pocket in front. It's easy to fit all the various odds and ends that you like to keep with you, including a good sized metronome and a tuner with no issues whatsoever. It also contains a back pocket. Now the back pocket isn't all too big, but you can still fit an orchestral portfolio in it, as long as you don't mind it sticking out a bit. It also fits iPads quite well, in case you're like me and you like to use electronic music over sheet music when you can. Although this case is small, it can fit almost any horn. So this horn is an original Geyer from 1952. It has a large wrap. Not only that, it was converted to a screw bell with the Yamaha ring, which makes the bell taller than most other horns. The inside of this case is fully adjustable. You empty out the case of the foam pads, you put the horn down in there, and you just adjust it. It's fitting in there comfortably, and then you place the pads back. As you can see, everything fits in there quite well. This case doesn't have any room for mute storage, but I personally see that as a good thing. I would rather carry around a case that it's smaller and more compact, especially when I'm traveling. And then when I get to my destination and I need a mute, or when I get to the gig and I need a mute, I just take my mute case and snap it right on. If you really need to carry a case that has room for mutes, then the MB5 Baby 2 is a great option. The MB5 Baby 2 is larger than the MB4, but compared to the very popular MB5, it is far smaller. It is shorter and it is a little slimmer. Like the MB4 Baby 2, the MB5 Baby 2 has a nice spacious pocket in the front for your oils and other accessories. It also has a back pocket, but like the MB4 Baby 2, you can't fit a full orchestral portfolio into it unless you're willing to have it stick out. On the inside, this case has room for a full straight mute and a stop mute. And just like the MB4 Baby 2, it can fit most horns because the inside is fully adjustable. This case also fits the Geyer quite well, meaning that it will fit most horns. However, if you have any questions about the fit of any horn in any case, you can always call us at Houghton Horns and we'll try our best to help you. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe if you liked the video, and watch out for more reviews from Houghton Horns.